And welcome back. As we continue to see the impacts of climate change around the world, how can we measure what exactly is going on here in Tennessee? Well, News 2's meteorologist Shelby Mack takes a look at the tool that's meant to measure that change. The Climate Vulnerability Index may be a mouthful, but it's also a crucial tool for communities to find out their biggest challenges as the climate continues to change. This interactive map pulls data in from 184 sets and ranks over 70,000 census tracts to find out which cities are most likely to be impacted by baseline and climate vulnerabilities. Dr. Wei Shui Chu, a professor at Texas A&M that partnered with the Environmental Defense Fund to help create this tool, explains how he imagines this valuable information can be used. Whether it's the city council or the, the county uh, government or the state government, to really advocate for you know paying attention to these areas that uh, and documenting it's not just like anecdotal evidence that um, you know that I that I feel that we're disadvantaged that there's actually data to back up how they're um, how they're more vulnerable. The Southeast has some of the most vulnerable locations on the entire map. Coming up, we'll talk about which spots in Middle Tennessee are the most likely to be susceptible to problems in the future. Back to you.